What's up, my great friends? I hope you're all having a fantastic day and great 30 days Flutter challenge. In today's lesson, we're going to learn about how to install Android Studio beta version along with the stable version. So you can have them both installed in Windows 10. So all I ask for before we jump into it is to subscribe to my channel and smash this like button and let's go for it. You go into Android Studio Preview in your search engine. Here we go. First link and then the beta build. So the 4.2 was recently released. We can download this. We agree to the terms. Download it. You select the location. Save. And here we go, we have it downloaded here. Let's open it. So it's a zip file, so we need to extract it first. Extract all. So you need to extract it somewhere beside the stable version. So for example, I have it installed in my D folder. Here we go. And then you can name it anything like Android Studio Preview. Just to make it like something unique. Here we go, the extraction has been successfully completed. So here in my D folder, I have the Android Studio Preview. So what you need to do is go inside this Android Studio and then inside the bin folder you will be finding studio.exe or studio64.exe. It depends on your system. If it's 64, you have to go with 64. If it's 32, you have to go with the studio.exe. Here in my case, I'll go with the 64 as my system is 64. And if you guys don't know how to find this out, you have to search for this PC. Then right click properties you'll be finding this out in the device specifications here system types 64-bit operating system let's go back you simply open this as i said we can have them both working at the same time so you don't actually need to uninstall the stable version and uh, install the better one here we go, we have it installed and active. Now if you guys can see, this is my stable version and this is the beta. I can start a new project. And I have the beta one here. There we go. I haven't tried it yet, but it looks good. The easiest way to reach it out by pin it to taskbar. Like you go here, right click into taskbar and you will be having this permanently here here we go perfect so we have them both installed now the beta and the stable version thank you so much guys for watching the video again if you're guys interested in tech tips coding especially flutter and dart subscribe to my channel give it a thumbs up let's push it forward thank you so much